Meg broke into Marine Corps base for pap shot as Kate while was in military outing. Why is Megan wearing a poppy? The Princess of Wales donned combat gear as she makes her debut in a new military role on Wednesday. Meanwhile, Meghan Markle also released pap photos for Veterans Day, just hours Princess Catherine Wiles fans on social media. Kate visited first the Queen's Dragoon Guards QDG in Norfolk for the first time as Colonel-in-Chief of the Regiment and was dubbed a natural as she drove a seven-ton armoured vehicle equipped with a machine gun. The Princess was appointed the role by her father-in-law King Charles in August. During her outing, Kate received a brief on the regiment from senior officers and had the opportunity to experience elements of what operational life is like for servicemen and women. Arriving in a black blazer, roll neck and trouser combo, the princess later swapped her outfit for a combat jacket and helmet. She also wears a poppy pin on her military outfit. Corporal Daryl Tukana, a driving instructor, sat beside Kate in the Jackal 2 as she visited Robertson Barracks in Swanton Morley, Norfolk. He drove her to a troop hide, then let her take the controls to drive them back to where they started. Kate exclaimed, It's really great, after bringing the vehicle to a stop, adding, It's very responsive actually, given the size of the thing. Corporal Daryl Tukana said of the princess afterwards, She was a natural. She drives a Land Rover back at home. I told her it's exactly the same. Just take it slowly and go back to where we started off from. She was enjoying every bit of the journey itself. It's different from what she's driving. It's a bigger vehicle. While many royal fans praised Kate's precious moments, Meghan also released that she and Harry visited Camp Pendleton in San Diego. They exploited their royal status to get access to a Marine Corps base. On Wednesday, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's organisation Archwell shared news that the two spent the morning with veteran and active duty service members and their loved ones at Camp Pendleton in San Diego, California. During the visit to San Diego, Meghan and Harry stopped by Operation Biggs, a first-of-its-kind mentoring programme dedicated to children of military families, including active duty veteran and Gold Star families. Noticeably, Meghan and Harry also wore poppies in their outfits, which the soldiers around them didn't wear. They only copied Catherine. Americans don't typically wear poppies on Veterans Day. Since that time is set aside to honour all living veterans, they should be worn on Memorial Day in the US and Remembrance Day in the UK. This is a desperate attempt to be royally relevant as the UK prepares for Remembrance Day. Whenever the British royal family has a major event, Meghan does PR tricks to divert attention. Does Meghan have a role in the US military? Meghan Markle's not a royal or a veteran. She's never served, nor has she been a military spouse. Why did Meghan leak the picture of her at a military base when Kate was also getting a military outing? Is it a coincidence? No. I just don't get it. Why Camp Pendleton gave Meghan and Harry the platform? Obviously a lot of people aren't happy. What do they represent? They're not royals, they don't hold any public office. So weird that organisations are entertaining these two. They're not backed by the British Foreign Office, Embassy or Consulate. This is their own dirty work. The US military has been taken for a ride. Harry is not an American, nor an American veteran. It's quite baffling these American military groups are entertaining the idea of Harry representing them.